so it's 2018 and we have a whole bunch of new type of tech from these 18 by 9 aspect ratio devices 2 in 1 devices but now the next revolution is a calculator hey everybody welcome to brand tech how are you all this is brand man 2 and this isn't necessarily a review but an overview of what I believe seems like the calculator of the future, the TI-84 Plus CE. To start off, let's go ahead and look at the front. I mean, it truly is a piece of high-tech equipment. I mean, it even looks more high-tech than my phone and computer, actually. I mean, this is not a cheap calculator by any means, but, I mean, just amazing that um, how good this build quality is. I mean, put side by side with my phone and the calculator pretty much looks like it's outshining the phone. Like, I mean, that's how good it looks. I mean, there's not really much of denying it. And, I mean, this is a $600 something phone. And this is a hundred something dollar calculator. I mean, in this case, I, I think I would actually take the calculator. Everything on this device seems very glossy from the front, and it does give it a good taste. Although the back is slightly more textured, so at least you won't be dropping it out of your hand. Unless you're clumsy like myself and you just repeatedly drop things. But even so, it should actually hold up pretty well. And another thing to note is that the screen is actually a bit bigger than that used on a normal calculator. Not to mention it is in fact backlit so I mean it really does look like a mini computer display. I mean in fact even brighter so I mean that's impressive for a calculator to be more efficient than like a smartphone. And for those of you about to ask where in the world did I put the batteries well, the battery container is located on the back, but you see little screws, so it's like, okay, so I just unscrew that and replace the batteries, and I don't know, I'll put like, um, some rechargeable triple A's or whatever, or is it double A's, or, come on, tell me what type of A's. Well, it's a rechargeable battery, and it charges via a mini USB port on the side. Now, mini USB is not the newest standard, and it's not even the old standard because USB type C is the newest one micro USB is the um, old one and mini USB is the old old one but the fact that a calculator is rechargeable using a USB standard I mean that's that's pretty good I have used the other versions of the TI-84 and the TI-83 and those ones require double A batteries which constantly have to be replaced the more and more you use it or the more and more you just leave it out so it's really a nice refresher the rechargeable smarts in a calculator and actually if you catch my unboxing of this calculator at some point in time I actually was going to go replace the batteries with rechargeables um, like rechargeable double A's but like I just mentioned, there is no need to as the device is already rechargeable. And actually, it's a better way than the rechargeable double A's to begin with. So it's a win-win situation. And also, on one of the final notes for this is, this is nice little sleeve. So, like all that trunks, you want to keep it in a case. So, I think this is your perfect studying tool. I mean, if you want a device that can use a calculator, I would seriously recommend this, and I do believe, in fact, that this is the calculator of the future. Thank you all for watching this. I hope you all liked it. If so, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And, and the note I'm going to end on is just remember what pi is, 3.14. It feels as if there should be a pi day. Hmm. And I'll catch you on the next one. Have a wonderful day.